Hey Leo, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for being here for your weekly reading. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And we're going to be looking into the weekly messages for you. Before I begin, I would just like to say thank you for being here. And of course, if you could please subscribe to the channel, that would be amazing. Um, and if you did want to become a channel member, you will get access to member only content um, and extended readings if you wanted to um, sign up there all you have to do is uh, hit the join button on the home page and all the instructions will be there otherwise let's have a look what's coming up for the sign of Leo <clears throat> okay we've got the two of swords Queen of Cups, and the Page of Cups. Okay, so strong Pisces, maybe a Cancer that's coming through in the cards. Could be a Gemini with the Two of Swords as well. Uh, okay, Leo, so I feel like there is a decision that needs to be made. I don't think it's in between two people. Uh, to be honest, Leo, I feel like someone you've been connecting or dealing with has been fairly immature. And I don't know what it is. I feel like they keep letting you down or they keep doing something that uh, hurts you. And it makes you really unsure about which decision to make about this person. Uh, now, the Queen of Cups tells me you have fallen for this person or you could see yourself falling for them. Maybe that's what sort of makes you feel bad for leaving them i don't know i'm picking up an energy that you feel guilt now for some of you like other stuff has happened to this person in their life before and you kind of feel like you're potentially abandoning them you've got this protective urge to look after them and take them under your wing right and now all of a sudden you're faced with the prospect of potentially walking away from this person and it's not sitting well with you i don't feel like you can make a clear decision because I think a part of you has all these wonderful feelings, right? You you have some history with this person, um, but the Page of Cups tells me there's emotional immaturity on their side. Um, now, that is that Pisces energy. So I also feel like they've been quite sensitive. Now, for some of you, I think this person has other stuff going on, Leo. Um, and if it's you that has all this stuff going on, I want to focus on you. I feel like what the cards could be showing is that there's other things that are potentially clouding your decision. I do feel like an emotional, like a DM or a heart to heart um, is coming up in the cards here, Leo. I feel like there might be someone who wants to open up to you here. And I think you're going to show us off the side of yourself to them as well. I get, I get a sense that you'll want to. Yeah, that's really sweet. That's really sincere i think it comes from a good place we've got the temperance so i feel like this is about coming towards this person with truth and honesty not hiding your feelings not hiding your intentions it's sagittarius energy but these two of cups makes me think it's a twin flame soulmate connection here okay so feel like honesty is needed in a situation there might have been dishonesty okay ace of crystals uh this is basically the ace of pentacles so it might be an earth sign as well uh but what i get from that ace of crystals is telling me this this could be a huge chapter with this person and I feel like you could see yourself really looking out for them and I feel like all these crystals are here which represent like healing power and strength it's like this person has come into your life to test your strength Leo it's so bizarre um, I feel like they've pushed you out of your comfort zone somehow and I think that's a good thing I do I feel like that's telling me there's a reason why they've come up for you I want to say 
a lot of you Leos are feeling like you want to move on to the next chapter in your love life, like you want to move forward, right? But then this page person comes up and, you know, maybe they're not all young, but I feel like they're inexperienced in love or they don't really know what they're feeling. And it's like you want that Ace of Crystals, but then you're looking at this page going, are they the one that is going to be this uh, Ace of Pentacles for me? And I feel like some of you might have this, like, you're doing something, you're working, or you're out and about, you're working out, you're going to sleep, and then you just have this sudden thought, like, is this the person? Like, is this the one I'm supposed to end up with? And it kind of, like, shocks you a bit, because I don't think you were prepared for this. So that's why I feel like honesty, temperance is coming up, because you have to prepare for the situation. A lot of you went into this didn't not thinking it would be how it has been. Like you came into it not thinking it would be this serious or that you'd grow emotions. So it's gone from something that you intended to maybe be more playful and it's gone to something more serious. I don't know. There's just something about this person that I think they've been through something here. And you, I think some of you want to rescue them, Leo. I'm, I'm, I'm getting, I don't know if this is making sense or any of you out there wanting to rescue this younger person or this inexperienced kind of energy. You know, maybe they're not younger. Maybe they were just very naive in their relationships, very naive in life. And people have taken advantage. And now all of a sudden, the mama lion or the papa lion has come up and gone, you know, no, no one's going to take advantage uh, uh, take advantage of it, this person. If anyone's going to take advantage, it's going to be me, you say. So, like, only you can inflict pain on them. Only you can hurt them and teach them and scold them and whatever else you need to do. So I do feel like there is an important decision and I do feel like your paths are very different. But for some reason they've crossed. And I keep going back to the fact that they've crossed because there's maybe a lesson tied into this. And it's about honesty and balance okay balance is super important leo i feel like whilst juggling this relationship you're also balancing something else in your life maybe you're moving you're full, having a fallout with a friend uh you could be trying to like change up your life change up your lifestyle you know you've got these new chapters in your life and i feel like for some of you this person has come in quite a turbulent during a turbulent chapter and I don't know if that's sort of affecting things. It may be. Sort of take yourself, you know, take the relationship out of the equation. You've got a lot of stuff, other stuff going on. So you may be blaming the, this connection or blaming something here. To be honest, I, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of you were juggling a lot of other stuff, Leo. You're in that Two of Swords energy. So go easy on yourself. Go easy on this person, I feel, as well. Um... But I'm going to wrap it up there, Leo. So thank you, everyone, for tuning in. It really does mean a lot. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That would be amazing, and I love you forever. And also, uh, if you'd like to become a member, please do so via the Join button, and I'll see you on the other side. So uh, thanks again, Leo, and bye for now.